So what is in that, Dr. Adams? They start the stem cells with PRP and exosomes. They went into a bladder. It's 1.8, so we're going to put 0.9 on each over. Okay. okay. First step is to clean um, vagina and all uterine. So uh, we can make sure we're doing a sterile procedure. Uh, I'm going to apply a specular, vaginal specular. We have a line that is the guide where the needle is going to be um, running. The critical point about the procedure is to found uh, the ovaries. Uh, usually with this kind of patients, it is difficult per se because the ovaries are very tiny. Um, they are coming with us because of a problem of fertility, so the ovary is usually very tiny. Actually, it's very easy, the procedure, but it requires a practice because when we work near to the ovaries, they are um, vessels, big vessels. Uh -huh. So that's the, the dangerous part, okay? We have to be very sure that the structure we're seeing is the ovary, because if not, we can uh, uh, work in another part, and that's very dangerous. So pull on the needle, and we're going to be uh, putting the stem cells. In a moment, you will be seeing a flash in the screen of the ultrasound, and that's indicating that it's uh, going there, the stem cells. Yeah. Uh, it's a safe option, but you need experience doing it because of the, of the steps, critical steps that I already talked about. Right, yeah. right. Yeah, you, you have to train your eye to distinguish the structures. That's basically it. Yeah.